Good morning. Today's Saturday and Fred and I are going to get some groceries. Some very much needed groceries and I'm going to show you that haul when we return. I'm all bundled up because baby it's cold outside. See you when we get back. Hi everyone, we got back from Walmart in Amherst and I'm gonna show you a little bit of a haul that we have. Actually, it's a pretty good size haul because we were out of so much stuff, out of vegetables and fruit and everything and some meat and we had to pick this all up today. And I'm gonna, st I'm gonna start off in the produce section. I'm gonna show you the vegetables. And if you see a mess in the background, we took our Christmas tree down last night and we are working on getting the rest of the stuff put away very slowly, but yeah, we're not done yet. And the house is a little bit of a mess and I apologize, but it is what it is. And anyway, let's get into this grocery haul and I'm going to turn you around and show you exactly what we got. And I'll tell you at the end of it, exactly what we spent. <sighs> Here we go. Okay, like I said, this is from Walmart in the produce section. We have some leaf lettuce. We go through a lot of it. So we got two bags and they're pretty full bags of leaf lettuce. Just a head of lettuce, a red cabbage, a couple of green peppers, some broccoli, an English cucumber, some green onion, some radishes, great big bag of radishes, and a stew pack because I'm going to be making a stew sometime this week. Probably Monday I'll be making a stew. And for the fruit section I got some more Granny Smith apples, some red delicious apples for Fred, some lemons for our salads, two bunches of bananas. I like the darker green and Fred likes the more yellow. So mine, Fred's. Three bags of grapes. There's not very many grapes in each bag. So I got three bags of those. Some Cara Cara oranges. We got, these were on sale, so we got two bags and we do eat a lot of oranges for breakfast and everything. And if we go on a little day trip or whatever, we like to take oranges along. So far, this is the produce that we got from Walmart. And over here, I needed some more pickles and those were the last ones on the shelf, so I grabbed them. I got some magnesium gummies those are for me and zinc for Fred and four cans of mushroom gravy. We don't use a lot of gravy, but it was on sale. So we got some and for snacks, Fred got some hickory sticks. I got three bags of my vegetable wavy chips, my veggie wavy chips and a couple of box of Smarties. And there's nine little boxes of Smarties, these chocolate covered candies here in Canada. And that's what they look like. And I just have one of those a night when we're having munchies with some of my chips. So that's the snacks. Now I'm gonna take you over to the, the frozen section and the meat section as well as the dairy. Starting off over here, we picked up a meat lasagna, two boxes of wild caught breaded haddock fillets, and we really love these. We eat these a lot. These were on sale for three something, 397 I think. So I got three pizzas just, when we just don't know what to have, we just throw a pizza in. Fred got himself some bacon. This was also on sale. I can't remember how much, but it was, I don't know. It was a decent price, a really decent price for bacon. 
So we got three of those for himself and for when the family come over and have breakfast and stuff. And I need some more turkey bacon, I think. I think I have still a package or two in the freezer, but I grabbed some more while we were out and about, which isn't very often. We picked up a barbecue chicken for tonight, along with a side dish of carrots and a salad. In the dairy section, Fred needed some coffee cream, so I got two of those. Um, some craft singles for sandwiches or on the bagel when we have like chicken burgers or whatever. This was on sale, so I got two of these. And these are the light version. There's no fat-free version here in Canada that I've ever seen, so we get the light version of the cheese. And I got some more Laughing Cow Herb and Garlic, and I like this on my bagel. I eat Weight Watchers whole wheat bagels, and I like to have that on it. Even when I'm having a chicken burger, instead of mayonnaise or anything like that, I'll spread one of these on it and have a cheese slice and some lettuce, and it tastes really good. Now I'm hungry. <laughs> um, for Nina, it's more milk. I'm not a milk drinker, except on the very rare occasions. Um, picked up calorie wise creamy poppy seed dressing for a salad. The Fred likes to have that on the salad as well as lemon. I just like lemon. And this hurt a little bit. It was still high. Is this was six dollars and something? This was a sale. Um, it's hard to believe, but that was on sale. So it's just salted butter. We were low, so we had to get some of those. So this is everything, everything you see here on this table, and I'm hoping I did not forget anything. This is everything from Walmart, and there goes Cuckoo Clock. Yes, the cuckoo clock seems to go off every time that I am recording a video. <laughs> That's okay. So yeah, this is everything that we got from Walmart. And I have the damage report right here. So, what we paid for Walmart is a total of $289.79. Groceries have really jumped in price. There was a few sales like like the pizza and the gravy and the oranges they were on sale the rest of it not so much I think the chicken was actually on sale too I think it was I think Fred said it was $9.99 or it was less than $10 and usually it's like $11 $12 maybe sometimes $13 for a chicken but that's it smells so good walking in the store Walmart knows what they're doing so we grabbed that and we're going to have that with salad and carrots for supper tonight. If you're wondering why whiskey did not jump up while I am recording this, I gave her a little treat as soon as we came home and she's being really good. Where is she? There's whiskey. You know she's not far away. You say hi. Say hi friends. Hi friends. So there she is. That's our Walmart haul. Yeah, the prices are a little bit insane for almost $300 for just, you know, a table full of food. But we got some stuff that's gonna last us for a while and I'm gonna make a stew and maybe sometime, um, maybe next week I'll make a chili try to make this last and make it stretch as long as we can until next week so so this is our haul for the day and i hope you enjoyed it